Hello there, and welcome to Comstock Infinite. First, we were a booker that hadn't been baptized and thus hadn't become a Comstock, but we were drowned before we, we could become a Comstock, because they didn't want to take the chance. Then we were an old Comstock, who were thought they were a booker, but we were actually a Comstock. We were in Rapture, and um, our daughter, I guess, still, <laughs> searched us out, put us on a case, for a girl we were already searching for, Sally. And she still hated us, and we found the girl, and she was turned into a little sister, and we got drilled into the chest, so we're a dead Comstock. What's gonna happen in episode two? Let's find out. Yes. Um, sure, why not? Let's have a... Previously on Bioshock. Me, son, you were born to do great things. They were right. Oh, a total Bioshock. Okay. I aim to keep you alive. Yes, yes, Fontaine. That's a child down there. She's a little sister now. Somebody went and turned a sweet baby girl into a monster. It's Ryan. Goddamn Andrew Ryan. Head to medical. Would you kindly get this? Would you kindly find that? Would you kindly? Would you kindly? Yep, that was the phrase to make me obey him. Ryan's office and kill the son of a bitch. Did that airplane crash, or was it hijacked? Yep. There ain't no Atlas, kid. The name's Frank Fontaine. I had you built. I sent you topside. And we killed you. Yep, he got his just desserts. You saved them. You gave them the one thing that was stolen from them. Oh, a chance. So that's the canon ending, saving the little girls, which is what I did. And I guess this is Bioshock 2 then, when we were... No, okay. Just Bioshock 1. Gotcha. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. I guess since we were in Fontaine, thingamajingy, and we saw Atlas posters, they wanted to... Sally! Sally, come out! She wasn't yours, Comstock. No, you were. Elizabeth, I am so sorry. No, you're not. But you're about to be. Bzzzt. Yep, drill through chest. Or was it through the stomach? We died either way. Or did we? We must have died. Or did we? Paris? Mademoiselle? Yes? Quel est votre nom? Elizabeth. Pour vous, Elizabeth. Oh, no. No, I, I, I couldn't. I, I can't accept... Je vous en prie. J'insiste. Oh, thank you. So she did get to Paris. And we're Elizabeth now? Sure. Are we going to be able to open tears? And I see we're going to get copyright claimed to Helen back. That's fine. I'm a small channel, so it doesn't really bother me. It does get blocked in Russia, though. Comment ça va, Elizabeth? Eh, ça va bien. Bonjour, Monsieur Sirot. Ah, bonjour, Mademoiselle Elizabeth. Je manque d'inspiration aujourd'hui. Oh, I think you have a lovely view to paint, but I guess if you see this view every day, you may get bored of it. Also, this looks. This looks way too perfect. It's too... Yeah, it, it's too good. This is, something is wrong here. <laughs> Bonjour, Elizabeth. Bonjour. <laughs> of course, there's a little French kid Comment dancing around with some bread. Of course, there is. <laughs> 
uh, flower or something. Journée, mademoiselle. Bien, bonjour, mademoiselle. Yep. We're not really here, are we? <laughs> Comment ça va, Elisabeth? Vin rouge, vin blanc, red wine, white wine, and croissant. Cabbage. Call your children cabbages. Ooh, cheese. I have no idea what what's happening. We're probably gonna get, go back to Rapture at some point because it's still called Burial at Sea. And uh, we did, did get the Bioshock 1 uh, recap. Painfully short as it was, but took up all the important story beats. And Jack, thank you. I got the name back. The one I had forgotten. I'm, I'm still doing well. Thank you. Titter, titter. Giggle, giggle. Yeah, this seems like someone's ideal. Uh, ideal um... Bien, yeah, sure. A I someone's ideal dream. Bonjour, mon ami. Alors, tu as parlé à la jolie petite américaine? Oh, bonjour, mademoiselle. Mission of France. Yeah. Bonne journée. Comment ça va, Elizabeth? And everyone knows her. Yeah. Oh. oh. I'll play along. Let's see. Let's see where we end up. Hello, hello. Everyone knows me. Everyone adores me. Everyone loves me. Yep. Hey, you were in. Next time, I promise. Cassette. 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 Why do I remember that name? Also, you're the children from Colombia. Cassette. Cassette. That's closed. Cassette. Maybe it's just from another game. Bien le bonjour, mademoiselle. Bien le bonjour, Elizabeth. Ooh, bonjour, bookstore. Mademoiselle. Je peux vous vendre tous les livres que vous voulez. Et pour pas cher en plus. Do you have The Age of Innocence by Edith Wharton? Désolé, ma petite. Celui-là n'a pas encore été écrit. Has not been written yet. Yep. We, this is not real. Thing is this... Just... Une baguette, mademoiselle? No, thank you. Bonjour, mademoiselle. Would that pick up line work? That, that sounds overly cheesy. There's a lot of cheese. I do like me some cheese. And the music seems to be crescendoing to something. Oh. Who do you think you are, Belle? Or the cage. I remember we had to, we had to choose between that when we were in Colombia. I think I chose the bird. Because in my mind that symbolized freedom. You're conveniently placed. Um, the music just died out. <clears throat> Still slightly irritated throat, so probably gonna be a lot of coughing. A little sister, Sally? Sally? Sally! Uh oh. Night time. 
vampire time. There's the balloon. Everyone disappeared. So is this gonna be... Uh, is this gonna be another Elizabeth? Now we just have a lot of profiles instead of actual pictures. Instead of the one... The old one who... Tricked Booker? Comstock? Sorry. Bookstock? Sally, wait! Come back! Come and back. got his chest mm -hmm. drilled through? Wait! Oh, yeah. Ooh, hello. Things on fire. Sally, stop! Come back! <laughs> can I run? No, I can only walk. Sally, where are you going? Lobotomy? <clears throat> no, thank you. Holy shit, look at that. Oh. Come back! Sally, hold on! Come back! Ace of Spades? Why was that so prominently shown? Remember Ace of Spades. We're walking slightly faster. Oh. Oh, are you starting to remember your childhood? I think so. She was basically prisoner in the tower and they performed several experiments on her and I still can't get over the whole gathering her blood and keeping a close eye on her menses. Come back! Stop, stop! Wrenches? Wrenches. That was the basically the melee weapon in Bioshock 1, wasn't it? Were you there before? Or are you actually the guardian angel of Colombia? Where did she go? Who knows? This way. Down there? Probably. Too narrow hallway. Not allowed. Right then. Yes, let's go meet Comstock. Oh no, we're here. Go away. It wasn't my fault. Yes, it was. Yes, you did. No. No. no! It wasn't my fault. Leave me alone! Can't you just leave me alone? I'm sorry! I'm sorry. I never should have left. I never should have left you there. Are you talking to actual Sally or little sister Sally? Because it's kind of your fault that she, if she burned up. Empty. Empty again. What are the odds? Sally? What's the hold up? Just having a bit of a laugh, Atlas. This okay. ain't a sporting event. Put a bullet in her. No need to torture the poor girl. We're not animals, you know. All right, all right, all right. Let her go! Quiet down, dear. In a minute, <clears throat> all your problems will be over. Elizabeth, tell him you can get him back. Booker? Uh, Booker, say, what? I don't understand. I can get you. How? Say, I can get you back to Rapture. What? Just say it. I can get you back to Rapture. Put the gun down. 
Now, what was that you said about Rapture? I can get you back to Rapture. And how right. you plan on doing that, sister? You some kind of magician? Su Chong. What? Tell him Su Chong. Oh, that fucker. Su Chong. And how do you know that slant eyed wonder? You're his lab assistant. I'm his lab assistant. If it escaped your notice, Andrew Ryan sunk us 5,000 fathoms below his shining city. How does Su Chong propose to get us back? That's between me. That's between me. And the slant. And the slant. Yeah. But if I do this, the girl goes with me. Little sisters are worth their weight in gold. She's not up for negotiation. Last time I checked, back in the city they were making little sisters by the dozen. That's a right fairy tale you've dreamed up, sister. But if you're lying, we can just as well kill you tomorrow. But down here, we got no <coughs> but time. In case I need to get hold of you. If you see Su Chong, tell him. Atlas says he hasn't forgotten him. Oh. Okay. This is how uh, Fontaine gets back to Rapture. Elizabeth. Come on, it's time to get moving. Looker? What? Over here, on the radio. You're not Booker. Well, of course I am. Yeah. What have I gotten myself into? I didn't orphan that girl. I didn't kidnap her. Uh, but she made for some exceptional fate, didn't she? It did you, sir. Okay, pick up. Gotcha. Had to be done. Did it. I felt everything that every version of me felt. All of that knowledge. I lost a pinky, but that version of me, she lost everything. And Comstock, that final Comstock, he thought he could avoid his guilt by coming here. You educated him proper. But then why am I back here? Huh? I don't remember opening a tear to come back. And who are you? Huh? I think you'll figure that out soon enough. Wait, final Comstock. So have uh, we will has Elizabeth been going around killing every Booker slash Comstock along all the timelines? And you were the last one? I mean... In, in, in that regard, if, if she has been going around killing all the bookers, the entirety of episode of Burial at Sea doesn't really make sense. She could just have gone in there, poop, 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 killed him and then teared out of there. Right? Why do the whole song and dance with Sally as bait and everything to get him here and get him drilled through the chest was just for for him to die more painfully this is why you should not go if, <laughs> if you're an evil overlord or something similar like that an evil villain or something you don't go the roundabout way of doing things if you see someone who's a threat to you or someone you need to kill you kill him Otherwise, shit like this happens. But if that's what she was doing, killing all the Comstocks, she was just being a dumbass in episode one. Episode one didn't have to happen. She just had to go in there, kill him, and tear out. But she didn't. Alas. Maybe she was too... too... Um, mired in grief and hatred? I don't know. Will we ever find out? I hope so. See? Big hole in his chest area. <clears throat> okay, exit the toy department. It looks kind of like how I remember it. In here is where we turn up the heat. This is where we fought the big good daddy. Down over yonder is where I had the motorized Patriot helping me. Okay, cannot go down.
What this? Claim wreckage. Because there's no other way out. Okay, so I guess we are going now. Okay, fine. So we're the older Elizabeth then. Because she remembers doing this and tearing out and she doesn't remember coming back. Or? Yes. I already don't remember the dialogue we had. Is there a recap of the dialogue? Ooh, guns. Crossbow. Crossbow. Tranquilizer. Ooh. I have nothing else. Huh? The whole... I would like a dialogue recap. Oh, anyway. Because my memories. I was in Paris. I, I was happy. And now I'm here dealing with this Atlas, this, this psychopath. What was I thinking? I wasn't Paris any more than I am Booker. Now I have to find this, this Su Chong. And the Butcher. I don't even know who that is. Not yet. But you know he's the key, don't you? To what? You're asking me. Elizabeth. I ain't even here. Is that your subconscious, then? Your guilt? But she was painted as a younger Elizabeth, but again, that was... It was basically part of her delusion, so she could have just thought she was younger. We'll see what happens. Too many freaking things are going on. It's a very empty toy department. No money, no guns, no nothing. I have half health. Not even a shield. Up there is where we want to go. It's actually 5,000 fathoms. How, how much is a fathom? I don't know. I don't know nautical terms. Matryoshka dolls? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Move rubble. What are you? Huh? And how did you know exactly what to tell Atlas? Let me ask you a question. Are you feel like yourself, Elizabeth. I feel I feel strange and smaller. I, I can't see the doors. What's behind the doors? I I can't see the future. I can't even see any tears. <gasps> oh, hi. Oh my god. S stay away from me. Booker. No. No. No, please. Please don't. I died here. I was killed by that. Stay away from me! Ooh. But then, how am I here? How can I be dead in this world and yet... Yep, you're from another timeline. My finger... What am I? Huh? I don't understand, I... I... If we're going to end up in the same place, we need to harm and to ride. Are you being cute? I've come round to your way of thinking. Have you? Yes. I do believe one can change things. But after all the bother, one often wishes that one had not. You're a fatalist. A physicist. A fatalist. So was Newton. Especially when it came to apples falling from trees. They always contrived to land with a splat. She left the child to rot. Are you implying she's the apple? I'm implying that she did not fall far from the tree. And now she wants to go back. I need to go back. To fix what I broke. Back to where she has no right to be. Back to where she doesn't belong. Doesn't belong? Wait, what do you mean? Do you want to tell her brother, or shall I? Because I died. There are rules. Even for one such as you. She'll forget. All the doors. And what's behind all the doors. All closed to her now. She'll be just like the rest of us. Forgetting the past. The present. The future. I'd wager she won't even remember this conversation. We've arrived. Basically, what happened to Booker as well?
You're trading nope. omniscience and croissance for death and mildew. I left Sally to rot. For what? So I could punish Comstock? He was trying to help her, to save her, and I... If I don't make that right... We all have our crosses to bear. But there is a thin line between a martyr and a fool. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so she at least feels regret over Sally. That's good. Yep, this is the Bioshock 1 lighthouse. The Lutesses warned me that if I came back here, I would collapse. Collapse. From a, a, a quantum superposition to just me. Uh, quantum what? I've changed, Booker. No tears, no cosmic knowledge. Just a normal girl. With a normal <coughs> pinky. Hey, it, it, if I can't open tears, I, I'm never leaving here, am I? I'm never going back to Paris. Nope. And you, you're just... You're, you're just what? You're, you're just the fragments of my memory telling me what my future holds? You decided to come here, Elizabeth. You knew what that meant. Only option, as I see it, is to trust yourself. Find Su Chong. All right, so... We lured Booker here with Sally, got the big daddy to kill him after we almost shut it down, and then the big daddy turned on her, probably because <clears throat> she put Sally in danger. Because we know how the big daddies are with their little girls. Little sisters. Sorry. Sure. Sure. I'm not looking forward to seeing Su Chong. I remember him being very skewered by a big daddy on a table. That's more than... That's better than he deserved. I, I don't remember the... Exactly what it was, but I do remember him performing horrible, horrible experiments. I think it was primarily on the Little Sisters. Or it could have just been on Pew. He was a, he's a horrible, horrible man. Oh, man. I, I closed for you. For 15 years. I closed for you. And now... Yeah, so we have kind of sneak lines when we're crouching this time. We're gonna be What's more stealth based. Why are you always number one and I'm always pulling up? I think I'm gonna have to use this air grabber. It's gonna be messy. I don't know if well, a blow to the back of his head will serve just as well. Be a hell of a lot quieter too. And that's not what you would have done. I'm not Booker. Just because your father did something one way doesn't mean you have to. <clears throat> Thus the tranquility crossbow. Come on, lady. Let's work something out. How about now? Is it that tart with the paper? Spine on me again. That kinda looked like exclamation points over his head. I don't I don't have anything. We're not finished. Aren't we? Huh? Are you you huh? Keep on doing stuff over there. Ryan the Lion, Preparatory Academy. You'll want to get the drop on him, and quiet. Shh. He can't hear what's only in your head. <clears throat> sure, that's the, uh, the crouching and sneaking. That's what I've been lacking. And it's a fault I intend to fix. 
Okay. Uh, huh? I've always been there for you. I have nothing. No weapons or anything. Did I did I miss something up there? Because I have nothing. She did say something about a skyhook, but I didn't see anything. Now I'm, now I'm dead. Up to us to see they become Grishina. Something must be done about Fontaine. While I was buying buildings and fish futures, he was cornering the market on genotypes and nucleotide sequences. Okay. Rapture is transforming before my eyes. The great chain is pulling away from me. Perhaps it's time. Yep. Uh, I still don't have any weapons. So, how am I supposed to get the drop on him when I can't do anything? Huh? And I can sneak right up to him, but I can't do anything. Did I? Did I fuck myself? Did I miss pick up something? Can I steal your weapon? Can't do anything. Steal my leads. Ow! What about if I run out of here? Well, that's a lot of people. We're definitely supposed to be sneaking, but uh. uh I couldn't even steal anything, so dunce hat. That, that's what I need. I need a big old dunce hat on my head. Fetch that black label lattice, Can I Let's pick up a basketball? Throw throw it in their faces. No, oh, there's something. I have money. Um. <laughs> I must have missed picking up something. Or that. Wait. My little sister? But no, I can't be, because in that case, they wouldn't be trying to kill me. They can use the vents to travel around. Make more of you, okay? So maybe I am a little sister, but they want to kill me anyway. I mean, I like the part in what's it? Well, Bioshock Two, I think, where we did play a little sister for a little while. Okay, uh, let's try this again. Oop. I mean, no, I I feel tall. I mean, those no, those vents are pretty pretty large. I'm probably just an average sized woman. Okay, money. Um intellectual superhumans who in the act of their becoming will destroy. Mean I guess I could just usher in the new lure him revolution and then go in here. Bent to go there. Horror of shame. I have no lock picks. Things always slow down in the summer. It's like the heat. I will not I share want. my toys. Oh. Okay, let's let me take. Who's that? No one. Shush. You're not getting out of this deal out easy. Ain't I? Ain't I? Really? 
Oh shit, you're walking around there. He's walking around. Sweet idea for you. In this way, when we lay waste to your mind. Lay waste to my mind? Hi. Oh, they can hit me while I'm climbing up the vent. Fuckers. Okay, so if you're out there. No! No, you're not. You're only hiding from yourself. Yes, because I know nothing. But we're not finished. Yes, you are. Ah! You never respected me. Thank uh, you. <sighs> 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 Okay, so completely different gameplay loop. Ah! Ah, I ain't letting a good lead like you get away. Aren't you? I just, I just want to get in here. You're not getting out of this deal, that easy. I can't open this. Why did you come in the first place? So. Got a sweet idea for you. Um, I don't know what to do. Jesus. I have no weapons. I have no keys. I have no lockpicks. I can't. I can't do anything. Ooh, dude. Why does eating chocolate sound like I'm getting a shot? Okay, so is there a lockpick or something hidden around here? Because I can I can clearly get them to move away from the door by showing myself hiding in the vents, running around. So I need a way to unlock the door, if I can find that. Should be fine. I would very much love a walk button. So I don't make as much noise. I don't, don't know do why I'm here. Rest, you'll be resigned to follow. Okay, please don't discover me. Oh, okay, he's just standing guard there now. Is that what you are? A cognitive primitive. Cognitive primitive? Is that what you I would love a lock. I would also love to be able to get back in here and maybe pick up if uh, what I missed. There's a, it's a never welcome. I know, I know. Ryan, I know. Both of you are down there at the door. Gotcha. Can I wait for you to open the door for me? I don't see anything. Mark my words. Palm of my hand. Uh huh. No idea what she's talking about. Draw a parasite you met today, Mrs. Turner. Daddy is a girlfriend. Mommy. Jeez, why did you make your mom look like a clown? Oh, that was just the lighting. I thought I found something. Uh, damn it! I think I can walk around in here safely. I don't say insurance Oh, I'm not finding anything. Do I need to restart? No, no, they wouldn't soft lock you. Right? Though they still did have the bug in episode 1 with the uh, the air cycling thing, so...
Okay, I don't think there's anything in here. Can't really explore here because them bastards are standing right there. You can't judge a man only by his bookings. Character's gotta come into account. At least they don't hear me walking around, so that's something. You were the worst How far does your line of sight stretch? Oh, is there anything here? Maybe? Giving nothing in return. That you were a child. There's no excuse oh. for a racket. Come out and show yourself. I guess they can hear me. Okay, whatever. I need to see if there's anything. Hi. I made you a solid offer. Most curious. Yes, I just need to Come. see if there's anything Let's there. Come follow me, metal. people. Follow me, boys. I'm gonna take you for a run around. Is there anything here? No. Nope. Can't open. Have nothing. So if we go into. Okay, we still have this jump skyline attached thing. I guess that's a thing for the entirety of the game. Play audio log on J? Fuck you. That... Okay, so separate keybinds. Depending on which part of the game you're playing. Check. I have... Uh, plasmid? Uh, we're back to plasmids? Okay. We're gonna get plasmids. Well, and use medical. Oh, we're back to Bioshock One controls. Gotcha. Uh, gonna gonna look through all that later once we're I. We're not finished. Um, once we get there, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm. On, I'm gonna run Let's around and. See if I can't figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do, and worst case, restart. Because I'm missing something. Yeah, um, I'll see you soon. Hi again. I walked around and I died enough times for Ryan to stop talking in the loading screens. Um, last time I just saw a bunch of posters with Ryan and Tenenbaum. I think it was Tenenbaum. Um, the heroes of Rapture, but it, she had the word bitch written on her. So I went into the options menu again and looked at things, uh, reconfigured things almost as I wanted them. Uh, I forgot to change the iron sights look now, I realize. But you know what I found? My melee button. It was... Keybound to V. Who the hell melees on V when you're using worst control? It's bound to my mouse now, so I can melee all I want. So maybe now I can actually sneak up on people <laughs> and whack them over the head. Let me go and fix the uh, the iron sights while I'm at it. Um, I even changed the plasmids. Uh, toggle iron sights. Right mouse button, please, please, thank you. And um, switch weapon E. Uh, don't like that either. Uh, but but now we're back to F. -F uh, sure. Wait, save changes. So now, okay, I think we're ready now. <laughs> Finally. I know real well Sneak up and whack him over the head. And I guess I picked that up automatically, whatever it was, because she's definitely holding something. I can't really see what it is, but... No, it's not the strongest that survived, but the fittest. Those most capable of... Hello. A good start. Sneaky, 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 fuck you! Well, he's not getting up anytime soon. And what with his head all attached to his body. From here on, it's only gonna get worse. And how much worse is up to you. Okay. He is definitely snoring, sleeping, so he's alive. Children, the clay. So I'm gonna try 
as I always try to go through this without killing people, but if they get detected, well, then they're gonna get a melee shot to the face, I guess. You can mold them for life. And at least now, we get you people to shut the hell up. Now, let's get his lockpick. <laughs> oh, there's the lockpick I was looking for. Okay. Learn how to pick locks. Ooh. Lock picking can be easy with the right tools and know how. Use your lock pick to probe a pin. A neutral pin will open the door. A blue pin will open the door and knock free a noisemaker. Okay. A red pin will open the door, but also sound an alarm. Mm hmm. So, blue pins is what you're saying. Oh, that looks. Simple enough. Just a six pin tumbler. Oh, but there's an alarm. I could come in handy, though. Could it? Okay, pick lock, one pick. We're not gonna do the red one. So this is slightly more akin to... Slightly. I'm not doing the upward movement. Akin to Oblivion's lock pick over Fallout 3, 4 slash Skyrim's. We I hate that lock picking. That's boring. Right. So blue ones, good. Red ones, bad. Neutral ones, uh, if needed. Okay. Michael Ramsey, Corey Stor, Oliver Hong. Okay, and medical kits on G. No. I'm gonna be running in and out of this menu. I feel. F is good for use. So I, I, I think I kind of maybe want that on E instead. And um, switch weapon on F. Perfect. Plasmid menu Q. Perfect. Toggle iron sight. Melee. Use medical kit. How about we use a medical kit over here? Have everything on me. But then we have plasmids. One, two, three, four is okay. So we're probably only going to get two weapons again, which is the Bioshock Infinite Way. One, two, three, four is Fine, then we can have one plasmid over here, one plasmid over here, one plasmid over here, and one plasmid just here. Nav aid on N. Okay, no. There we go. I do like me some sneaking. Always shoot to kill. Anything Ryan says, do the opposite. No, says Peter the Parasite. You must only buy fruits and vegetables. If I can afford to see the doctor, is it my concern that others cannot? No, says the damnable Parasite. We must all crowd our way into the position... I mean, it depends on how empathetic you are to other people's troubles. I mean, we can, we're kind of taxed somewhat highly here, so we, in a way, do care about if our fellow people can go to the doctor. It's very cheap. So, yeah. I like it. That means if I, if I get sick or I break a bone, I'm not gonna go broke. I'll just pay a nominal fee and it's fine. That was the little sister done. The doors, they're, they're, they're cracking open. My memories of the wait. future and, and, and somewhere I'm going to go. You sure it's your wait, future wait. you're looking at? If not mine, then... Wait, wait. Then whose? That might have been Jack. No, says the damnable parasite. We must all... Because we did go into a little sister den at some point. I just don't remember if it... It was probably Bioshock 1. Was it 2? I... Don't remember, okay? And you get them mixed up. I remember stuff we did, I don't remember exactly where in the timeline. Pretty certain it was one. Since this game has only referenced Bioshock 1. Hello, children. Can I turn I'm you off? The lion. I'm here to tell you about Peter the Parasite. Uh, Peter the Parasite. 
For the pacification of a disruptive children, aren't all children disruptive? That's the, that's kind of what they do. The children and you were stabbed in the back. Pick up crossbow. Mm. You sure you're ready to use that? It's a crossbow. Looks like the bolt delivers some kind of sleep agent. Probably fencyclidine or sodium thiopental. <laughs> they had all kinds of books in my tower. How do you mm -hmm. think I always knew what ammo to toss you? No one ain't the same as being ready. Mm -hmm. Why don't you ask Comstock how ready I was? Your father's blood runs in your veins, but it doesn't have to be on your hands. Yeah. It's up to you. Those who cannot create will always steal. Yep. 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 Plot twist, we're somehow Tenenbaum. Alright, boys and girls. What does Ryan the Lion tell us about the tragedy of the common? Peter the Parasite says Shit. Share Okay, and share. never mind. Uh I think I'm going back to See if 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 F is gonna be loot all, let's just have F for use. Yeah? Yeah. Cause I don't wanna go what? E F, E F, E F. Nothing. We must all crowd our way into the physician's office. Two plus two five equals four. Five, five minus four equals one. Nine you plus two equals. Well, we can't really display that here, can we? High and low. We search high and low. We are hunting high and low. Disruption behind us. Saving from the Back sky above. Looking for more and more once again. Hunting. Right. And get all that is your due. Get actual ammunition? We have vents. There are no excuses in Whoop. rapture. Uh. Stay away from me, lady. Did you ask to be brought into this world? Nope. If your parents expect anything from you, tell them to get it in writing. It's a surprise. <laughs> Shut up. Ooh. I get my nope. There was definitely something. Yep, yeah, this is what I saw. Here's a rapture, Ryan, visionary. Traitors of rapture. Tenenbaum, the biologist, is the bitch because she started to care about the little sisters. And caring about something that Ryan tells you not to care about is being a traitorous bitch. <sighs> I am gladly a traitorous bitch any time of the day, right? Rather than a Ry Andrew Ryan um, bobblehead. Yes, man. Yes, woman. Okay, let's save the vents. Because it looks like this is. And I have a one up there now, saying how many medkits I have. Okay. Actually. I did say that, that that was kind of one thing I did miss a little bit. Being able to use medkits whenever I needed to instead of only being able to use them whenever I walked over them. So I'm actually kind of happy to see that make a return. Uh -huh. Yeah. Can you imagine the smell in here? Freaking rotten fruit everywhere. Ugh. 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 Oh. Hello. I'm not done with the kitchen yet. I don't actually think I need to be sneaking around though. 
Because I got rid of all the sons of bitches over here. More money. Less problems. More money does not mean more problems. More money means less problems. Whoever said more money, more problems does not know how to be responsible with their money. Okay, good. That's still toggle? Yes. Creativity. Can I just use one weapon at a time? Yes, I think that's how we had it in... No. Very let's see, we could still have two weapons, but since it says hold... Please don't let me swap out my crossbow. Fuck. Oh, good. Ooh, ha, ooh, ha, ha. Okay, hand cannon in a pinch. Because I love the hand cannon. And the crossbow. I'm not going to pick up any other weapon because the weird thing about burial in c1 i couldn't ever ever pick up a weapon i had previously discarded even if i found it again i guess that could have been a bug and never really did the whole reload thing to check if it was or not but uh, i'm gonna say don't do that i'm gonna stick with these two weapons hmm Idyllic. This week's maker, Source C. Farley, and the week's taker, Jimmy Ward. Enjoy your child becomes a model citizen with Ryan the Lion Preparatory Academy. Rapture Woman, time-saving wonders, the gun I didn't like at all. Under the coffers with Andrew Ryan. Luxury you've earned, and because you're not one of them. <laughs> Principal's office? Proper discipline, official procedure. For pro problem children, use of possession is advised. Holy shit. Because we've only used possession in combat, and that makes people kill other people. So what happens if you possess a child? Are they going to go around beating other children up? I guess it has a civilian use somehow, but we've only seen the combat use. Please don't possess your children. Let them be their own people. Teach them good values and morals, but that's... Yeah. Right. Moving on. Open door. Oh. Look, Suchong. That's the name you had me tell Atlas. Huh. I don't follow. Looks like this character Suchong has taken over the Silverfin restaurant. Yep. That's that's where the tear was that I used when I first came to Rapture looking for Comstock. Before this place was turned into a prison. But the first time you came to Rapture was in 1960 with Booker. When you drown some over a year from now. Yeah, that that that's right. I wait, wait. when I could see all the doors, it all it all made sense, but now it now it's it's just a jumble. Elizabeth, you're, you're bleeding. Now I know what it feels like. Alright. If we're gonna find Su Chong, the Silverfin is the place to start. I know the why. Okay, so that's where we're gonna go. So, uh, wait, 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 wait. She used a tear in the Silverfin restaurant, which is in here, which is sunk to the bottom of the sea, when she came to Booker for the first time, but when we met Booker, this place was already sunk into the sea, 
So did she go there and immediately go to Booker and just seconds after that, that's when Ryan sunk the whole thing to the sea? Because it did seem like it was a fairly recent event. Or did she hide out in Rapture, searching for Booker for a longer amount of time? Until they had the, the, the time to sink this place into the sea. And what do you mean, drowned song? <sighs> the songbird? But that was a mechanical creature. Not really liable to being able to drown. I have so many questions. I am hoping to get a few answers. Hey, I didn't even see this vent, but this vent is here. Good to know. I could have completely avoided that woman, but she deserved a whack over the head. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Reach in there. Yes. All right, silver fit. Woo-ha! Okay. Right, remember to look up. <laughs> so I don't get stuck. Like in the first episode where I couldn't find the goddamn railings above my head. Yes, I think I'm ready to move on now. To the Silver Finn restaurant. Was that here? No, it was here. <coughs> Through the exits. I'm just gonna... Ah, uh, wet the old whistle a little. Alright, join us upstairs. Herald alarm systems, you'll know they're here. And yes, I'm probably gonna spend most of my time sneaking in new areas. Sex without compromise? Excuse me? Are we gonna watch some porn? is vitally important to society but there is no reason that the act of copulation cannot be pleasurable as well remember these tips sex is egotistical without self-esteem those participating in coitus are revealed to be fraudulent hypocritical animals ego is indispensable in the bedroom not too much though with your mate Intercourse can be mutually beneficial to both parties. Should be. Set out expectations with your partner beforehand, outlining the services you will provide one another. Maybe and not by a contract, though. Of the deal. Never forget, oral contracts and handshake deals are for starry-eyed gigolos. Always get it in writing. Your pleasure is your business. Remember, you come first. Nobody's going to keep an eye on your pleasure except you. Don't be left high and dry. Armed with this knowledge, go forth now and enjoy sexual congress the rapture way. Now Hard to you know. disagree on that last one. That should be something you and your partner do for each other. Otherwise, you're just going to treat the, your partner as a masturbatory item. Eh, we don't want that. I was actually going to wait going here until I had the... <coughs> sorry, possession? Well, I can't afford anything anyway. Ooh! No Shit. I, I didn't have enough money for that anyway. Wait, I bought crossbow bolts. But I didn't get any? What's this? Free men and free markets. Hit me. 
Are you in the know? There has been a lot of idle talk from gadflies and naysayers following the nationalization of Fontaine Futuristics. I believe in free men and free markets. Mm -hmm. But I also believe in my city. And it's a shitty Fontaine's city. Fontaine's purpose was nothing less than the destruction of Rapture. It was he who gave comfort to the laggards and layabouts. It was he who coddled the traps and vagabonds. Fontaine was poisoning the people of Rapture. But his venom wasn't made of arsenic or strychnine. No. It was concocted from something far deadlier. It was brewed from altruism. Now you know. Um, I would not call Fontaine altruistic in any... Any way at all. And also on the one hand, I, I don't agree with Ryan on a lot. But on the other hand, it is his freaking city. So I guess he should be allowed to have some rules and stuff. Oh. We're just gonna... Destroy as much as we can, because... Screw this place. Dum, 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 dum. Requires one pick! I didn't have the money for the pick, so it's gotta be... Okay, maybe in Cupid's Arrow then. Right near the how to have sex machine. Genderbender, liberation found fathoms below. Meet Chris, whose sexuality knows no boundaries. Good for you. I give no shit. Well. Right after I came through, I needed, I needed something to wear that was a little more rapture appropriate. Well, rapture appropriate. You didn't have these books in my tower. <laughs> I bet they didn't. Oh. Sinners at the pearly gates. Coeds never too late for. <laughs> it's never too late for an education. Mother, may I? Hello, Dix. The farmer's daughter, ready to get down and dirty. Isn't that an basically an old goodie when it comes to that topic? Appetite for sin, see the temptations of rapture through the eyes of a Midwest girl. If there's... Ooh, look, picks three of them. If there's one thing we can count on humans to do is to... Basically make anything sexually related. Because that's how we're wired, most of us. Ooh. He works hard, but plays harder. Big Daddy. Uh. Like I said, anything. Anything. Unfortunately. So that's all you have. Ooh. receive your letter regarding our new line of peeping tom plasmids and wish to respond thusly tough luck this is rapture miss what my customers do with my product is their business if you are feeling uncomfortable you are more than welcome to line the walls of your home in lead if you wish i could direct you to a reputable supplier peeping tom plasmid what? Turn every room into a peep show. Peeping Tom. There it is. So, X-ray vision, basically. And people use it, of course, to spy on others. As you know, a subset of people would. Okay, that's locked. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in.
Da, 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 da. Okay. Blue. Okay, reds. Ooh. Nice. What's with the carnival music, though? In a porn shop? No sensey makey. Unless you're trying to play a hey. carnival? There you are. There it is indeed. Not gonna pick up the dress? Who this? How many times have I asked Antonio for lockers with actual locks on them? I come back from lunch and the ensemble I just bought is gone. Stolen! But here's what takes the cake. The thief left an outfit in exchange. At first, I was gonna toss that thing, but then I kind of fell in love with it. <laughs> it's an old timey number with a corset, no less. It ain't exactly today's fashion, but I'm a girl who can tell good craftsmanship when she sees it. We were the one who stole that and left that behind. Left that behind. <clears throat> Thank you for the look. I don't even have an Eve meter. Also, why would I want to... No, I'll, I'll just go out the same way I came. I don't want to waste a lockpick there. There we go, there's my... Disappear from sight. Deep your walls. And sneak up on your phone. Splicers. I could use this plasmid and see them through the walls, or if worse comes to worse, turn completely invisible and get the drop on them. Okay, so I guess uh, see through walls is one click. Yep. And then I gotta. How do I. Okay, and then I hold it, I guess, for. Being invisible? Or is that a... Ah, while I hold, I'm invisible. Gotcha. Um, sorry. Fat cat. Ah! I wasn't prepared for him to come there. I told Santa Cohen I'm always ready to cut a record. I put on a show. Said he'd call. Because that's a very that's a very short see people through walls Recently, thing. I've been on some of a hiatus. Yep. What did you mean before when you said you were in Paris? That was in Paris. It wasn't really Paris. It was more. It was more the world as I want to see it. Idealized version of Paris. I suppose I wasn't really happy there. We'd all be better off, us to wits, if we could leave well enough alone. You mean us Comstocks? Though I guess he never changed his last name, so he was. He went from Booker DeWitt to Comstock DeWitt. Shit. Okay. So this is gonna be a heavy ever clean these focus seats? on sneaking, I feel. Oh shit, hi. I don't feel clean. Should I bathe again? I'll be late. So this is gonna be an go. issue when I have um the plus oh, shit. Doorknobs are my enemy. Oh they're not. <gasps> The button for plasmids on my mouse, right next to my button for melee. <laughs> so I'm gonna need a secondary button for melee. Uh, while I'm holding that one, uh, am I allowed to keybind this yet? No. Why am I never allowed to keybind that? Um. 
We'll get Z, Z, because I'm never going to use that one for anything else. Yes, let's have Z to be secondary melee. Perfect. Is that did you make a black ass big banana or just a very nutritious banana? That's what I'm wondering. Circus of you right, I was Oh, thank you. Nope. I was gonna see how much money do I have? 23, that's enough for some crossbow bolts. Uh, also lockpick, but uh, crossbow no tranquility. No wait, wait. Okay. Um. Put on your rubbers. Don't want to catch cold. I have a different. Um, how how switch ammunition? How switch ammunition, please? Because I, I don't want this this thing. I can't change ammunition. Plus mid iron sights. Plus mid menu melee reload. I tried reload. Maybe I should just instead of holding it, I should just. Nope. Um. Well. Get out here! Your supper's getting cold. I bought tri I bought tranquility bolts. You saw that. I even have no money left. Find it. Out. So. Even if I have Tranquility Bolts, I was forced to get an alarm thing there and it overwrites my current ammo and doesn't give my Tranquility Bolts back? That's horse shit. Because I bought these. Carrying three out of four. I can't... I can't get my bolts back. Is there a button to get my bolts back? I guess I will have to go look that up. Anyway, I'm going to leave this episode of uh, Comstock Infinite here. Right in the middle where I have no ammo. Anyway, yes. Thank you for being here and thank you for watching. Please take care of yourself. Make sure to try and be the very best version of yourself that you can be. And laters. I saw you looking at her, staring at her bosoms like some sailor. Ooh, bosom. <laughs>